Hey guys, sorry for the delay in getting this out. We've had a really busy end of the year, but it's time to announce the winners of the holiday giveaway. Well, at the end of this video. Let's start with project updates. First off, the Batman grappling hook gun. I know you guys want to see this in action, and so do I. We're almost done the Ascension device, but we ran into a few issues um, once we built it. Basically, it was vibrating like crazy. And that was because the motor shafts that we machined weren't perfectly concentric. And that's because we don't actually have a lathe in the shop, so it's pretty hard to do a concentric part. So what we've done is we've actually outsourced this to a local machine shop, which is why the project's taking a bit longer, because it, they had a lead time of a few weeks, and these shafts were expensive. I think we paid almost $150 each for them. So just to give you an idea of how expensive this project is, and imagine how much more expensive it would be if we had to outsource everything when we were making it. So I believe we're going to be able to pick up those parts this week, which means we should get back to work on the Ascension device really soon, and we'll have a video as soon as we're ready. Next up, we have the Flying Like Iron Man project. I know we haven't had an update in a while, and I really want to get an update out to you guys soon, but we want to make sure we have some actual content to show you. Basically, right now, we're trying to find some more sponsors so we can afford some of those more expensive parts to actually be able to make this. Our GoFundMe campaign is going quite well, and we've raised almost $3,000, which is amazing. But again, we need almost $60,000 for this project, and without it, it's just not going to be that easy to fly like Iron Man. We are still looking into manufacturing our own EDFs, but it is a bit of a slow process because of the risks involved. R&D is a slow process in the first place, and we are trying to fly in a garage. Like, who else is doing that? The Batman tumbler is coming along great. We've just about got the seat installed, and the motor is almost ready to be installed, which means in the next update video, we're going to be able to do a bare bones test to actually drive it and see what it can do. And then we're going to focus on upgrading it, adding all those bat gadgets, and making it one awesome vehicle. We also managed to get the boosted snowboard working last weekend. Um, the big issue we've had lately is the weather in Canada has been hot and cold for the past few weeks. It's literally raining today, which means we won't be able to test again for a few days. But this weekend we had a bit of good snow and we actually got my friend who's been snowboarding for 10 years to try it out and he was able to use the board quite a bit better than me. So stay tuned for the big test video. Um, as soon as the weather's better we're going to try and uh, get a proper video together and even just seeing the last video, a local ski resort actually messaged us and it sounds like they're interested in having us do the test at their ski resort, which is actually awesome. I can't wait to try it. What else? Oh yeah, the Red Hot Katana. Apparently, some of our subscribers actually unsubscribed from our channel because of that video. Seriously? Yeah, we hopped on a trend, but we were doing it as a parody. And I think we did it quite a bit better than all the other channels, seeing as we we're the first ones to actually do it with electricity, which is way more efficient than using a propane torch. And second of all, even if the video did go trending and viral, and it has actually already gotten way more views than most of our regular videos, we're just going to use that ad revenue towards our more awesome projects, like the Batman Tumblr, the Flying Like Iron Man project. So if you see a video that you don't like, it's, it's a trend or whatever, just don't watch it if you don't like it. It's as simple as that. Well, I think that's it for this update. Thanks for watching. Wait, I think I'm forgetting something. Oh yeah, the giveaway. Our Captain America shield winner finally got his shield after a whole bunch of issues with the shipping and the manufacturer, but he's got it now and he's super happy with it. And the cool thing is he actually has a YouTube channel too, so you guys should totally check it out. All right, all right, the holiday giveaway winners. So. Over 11,000 people entered the contest, which is huge. It's more people that have entered the contest than any other contest before. So awesome for you guys to actually enter the contest. Uh, it means that we're going to do a lot more giveaways because it seems like you guys are really interested in this kind of stuff. So for future giveaways, we're working with quite a few different companies and sponsors to see if we can get you guys some free swag. And we're excited to announce, but this isn't confirmed yet, We'll be giving away a 3D printer as well as 3D printer filament in one of the upcoming giveaways. Now again, that's not confirmed yet, but it sounds like a high possibility and we're working every day to get more sponsors on board to be able to do these awesome giveaways for you guys. All right, so who won the soldering iron? The soldering iron was won by Kyle Myers from Canada. Congratulations. The batarangs were won by Lars from Norway. 
The flask was won by Mamdo from Saudi Arabia. Wait a sec. Isn't alcohol legal in Saudi Arabia? The stickers were won by Rory Alpert from the UK. And the grappling hook prototype keychain was won by Nick Masri from the United States. Congratulations, guys. We'll be sending you an email to confirm you winning the prize, and then you can send us your shipping address so we can get that prize shipped out to you right away. After you receive your prize, please take a picture with it and send it back to us because we want to start a Facebook album on our Facebook page, The Hacksmith, showing off all the giveaway winners over the years. For everyone else who entered, stay tuned for the next giveaway. There's going to be many more chances to win. All right, that's it. Thanks for watching. Congratulations to the winners, and to everyone else, good luck next time. There's going to be more giveaways.